Skills levels test one, two. Turning my stuff up, ba ba ba. Saying things. Okay, cool. Sorry, I had some, recorded some VO earlier. And I did not change it back. Sorry I'm late, y'all. Um, it is, oh shoot, my levels are all off from doing Doki Doki. Let's turn that off. Close this. We need that for later for tomorrow morning. We can close this. Jeez Louise, so much stuff I have on my computer. Um, how's it going, y'all? I, uh, I was bad today. I didn't, um, Learned many impressive things. Hey, Tech. Thanks for the host. I got uh, some Thai food earlier. This is pineapple fried rice with chicken. Spicy level two. Um, it's tasty. And I shouldn't, I shouldn't eat the whole thing tonight. But I'm probably gonna. So anyway, uh, yeah. How's it going? How's it going? How's it going? Am I okay? I'm okay, Joey. Yeah, I just, um, I did some parkour today. We did, uh, or tonight. Um, we did, uh, what? Arch Mina, straight out of the gate, hit me with them bits. Thanks, girl. Appreciate you. Thank you. Um, we were doing rail walks. So, uh, eight, 10 feet high, and you walk on a rail, and then you walk back, not moonwalk, but you know what I mean, the other way, like that. Um, and yeah, you just get comfortable walking on a rail. Kind of like tightrope, but for me, it's not as scary because the rail feels very solid, and if I'm gonna fall, you, uh, you bend your knees, and you grab, you grab the bar, and you do a, a safety fall. So uh, that's the first thing you learn, is how to fall safely. So that way you can approach the activity with courage and confidence. Did pretty well. I think uh, I didn't bail at all. I made, I successfully crossed each time. So I think I'm gonna pass my test, my parkour test. Mm. What else? How was your guys' day? Yeah, I'll teach you guys. If we're at a convention together, I can we can do like a, a basic parkour class or something. <laughs> oh. Well. I guess we'd have to sign waivers and shit. <laughs> but anyway. Um Yeah. Sad thing, my teachers are probably gonna move to Los Angeles in 2021, which is a bummer. Kind of cool, because if I go to LA more, I can hang out with them. Um, Tempest Free Running is the name of the gym I work out at. So you're the newbie in training rookie noobs. Oh. Thanks for the follow, Lost Puppo. We'll get started here in a second. I'm just eating a little bit of dinner, sorry. I've been a little, little behind today. I bought a couple toilets. That's the most adulting shit you could do. I have two toilets in the back of my truck. I, I pulled out. I'm going to place some toilets in the house. A couple. Yes, Anya. Do dos toilets. Toilets. <laughs> um, both of the ones in the, in the house are running, and they're old. They're literally from, like, I would say 80s. They're old toilets. Um... Most importantly, like their inner workings are just garbage. So there's a sale on some, so I got a couple of toilets. Nothing, no big deal, demonic. Just bought a couple of toilets. But yeah, um, so that's what uh, that's what my day mostly consisted of was trying to uh, level up my my friend's house a little bit while I'm while I'm here. Uh, yeah, lots of change though. Having conversations with friends about 
what they're going to do in 2021. I know it's only July, July, August, September, October, November, December. We're halfway through, guys. We're halfway through. You guys have any money plans moving anywhere? You got beat up on you? Like from travel? Wait, Joey, where are you going? I love that emoji, by the way, address. <laughs> Sorry, I missed. I'm looking. Oh, Puerto Rico tomorrow? Hell yeah, Joey. That's badass. Sorry, I, I, yeah, I, I, uh, I just read it as you typed it. <laughs> Dope. The PR. Puerto Rico. Oh, shoot. Anya, you should have been taking parkour class with me before you slid down that cliff. But to be fair, we don't train uh, cliffside falls. That's some uncharted shit. <laughs> All right, just a couple more bites and we'll get going. Oh. I've never been to North Dakota. All right, Tamino. Um, yes, AB Guts. I talked to Aaron and Sarah. We're going to finish it up when our, our schedules all get together. Sadly, it's kind of hard for us all to get on the same page sometimes, like in regards to digging into a game together like that. But we're going to try to make it a regular thing where, like, we go on Sarah's stream and we, we play, like, uh, maybe a D&D &D match together and we invite one of our actor friends or something like that. I got, I had this green screen set up, so it worked out pretty well with them to come over and, and just jump in my room and record here. So although we did, it wasn't quite, it wasn't quite big enough because um, Aaron had a little bit of the, the blue wall over, over this way, like kind of sticking out. But um, I appreciate you guys uh, going to that. It was super fun. Man, doki doki, you guys. <sighs> Freaking Monica. I fought so many impulses to, to look it up to look up ways to murder her. And I know, I know vengeance isn't the way. We're literally playing Last of Us Part Two. Vengeance is not the way. And yet, I deleted her. Yeah, apparently something bad is gonna happen because I deleted her, but I don't know. All right, all right. Putting the food away. Mmm. Oh, I have a melty piece of ice here. Oh, yeah, Raka. We're totally going to play Doki again. But um, not tonight. Maybe tomorrow night. Maybe. I'll ask them. Uh, it's not my typical stream night to stream tomorrow, but uh, I'm going out of town for a week uh, for a wedding. So I may, um, I don't know, may just try to finish it up. But you, uh, I read that the whole thing is six hours long. So we played for like five hours. So I feel like we're pretty close to the end. Um, but uh, I, mean, I guess we'll find out. Uh, Riri Chanel Rick. That was a uh, pineapple fried rice with chicken. Spicy level two. With no basil. Um, thanks, Clarion. Yuri, though. I know, Joe. He, we were we were wooing Yuri, Yuri first. <clears throat> Finding strings. Thanks for the heads up address because we were curious about that last night, um, and it appears to me that we could spend more time trying to like dive into it. You know what I mean? To try to find out more about Monica. Like there were some files that I found in the in the Doki Doki folder that were like leading to websites and other stuff that seemed kind of suspicious, but anyway. I think those emotes are cute, Tech. Who is that pink haired girl? 
You hear that bass? Damn. Cars driving by bumping that bass. Wait, you so you're in New York now, Demonic? Dude, we gotta go to sleep no more in October if we're allowed. If you're down, Demonic, that'd be badass. Um, if you're Manhattan area, I'm going, um, I've got tickets anyways for like Halloween. It's supposed to be this is crazy like adventure, uh, but. Oh. oh no, that's cool. You went far into the lore. I want to. Like, that's my headspace. I want to right away, and not even, like, in a, to break the game. I, I want to, or, like, you know, like, cheat codes. I want to, I feel once, once Monica, like, gave that, you know, that moment with, uh, with Sayori, I was like, game, the gloves are off. I'm, I'm gonna hunt you down now. So, oh, I'm like floating, by the way. Let me fix that. Sorry, y'all. What if I do this? Eh, oh, wait, that's not helping. That makes me burger! <laughs> Sorry. Here, we'll go over here. And we'll go down here. There we go. That's better. Man, shut up, Tommy. Oh, you're from the Philippines? Hell yeah. yeah. Filipino. Oi. Como esta cana? Yeah, this is a super nice place, Anya. You can see. Everything's really good in here. Um, I, I think I probably picked up the items that were in here. Never mind. I thought I did. Why is Tommy, like, doing that? Is he trying to force us to go? I'm confident I already read this, but I'll pick it up again. Hey, what's Just... the savage star like oh, doing here? Maybe I didn't. Pretty sure that's Joe. Hmm. I should read it. Rotate it, rotate it, rotate it. You guys remember Tess from Last of Us, the first one? Tess was badass. Oh, is it? My bad. Uh, here. I think I also. I think I turned it super far down for Doki because Doki was overpowering us. I had all all three of our, um... oh, my bad. This is gonna make me super loud. Sorry, y'all, hang on a second. Hold on a moment. Ooh, this is gonna be loud as ball. Test one, two, three. No, it's still okay, levels are fine. Uh, and let me do this. And then fixing levels for you guys. Give me a minute. Do 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 do. Gotta fix the stuff. Ba da ba. Okay, should be a bit better now. I'm gonna talk to Tommy and see if it'll if it'll work. Oh yeah, Anya. So I was trying to figure out ways to, uh, rather than do like subscriber goals, I had folks that were like, hey, if you don't care about like you know, not don't care, but like put a priority on people like subbing to your channel, you could at least do like followers. And I was like, oh, well that'd be nice. Cause then if like I hit some kind of goal by the end of the month, like, and it makes sense that people are following and want to see me stream, then I should do something cool for y'all. So I'm figuring it out. I'll probably do some kind of like special show stream for you with like, I don't know, songs that we worked out on our, on our sing along Sundays. But hey, is the audio better by the way? With Tommy? Hang on. I feel like it might be too loud now. Game's been good. El Crematas. Um, I've enjoyed it. Oh man, it's that I didn't shows I didn't pick up anything. What the heck? 
We got alcohol. We got... <laughs> Anya. Well, it's not like, I guess like a super official thing, but like kind of started doing it. Um, but making like a list of, of songs folks like to hear or want me to like cover and I can try to do it like for a performance. Oh, check it out. Here, I'll do this real fast. Like, look, I have a... Look at my... Look at my... Uh, look at the coffee shop we're in now. So like... On sing along Sundays, it could be like, just be hanging out. Sounds of, of coffee, coffee shop going on in the background. I don't know. Let me see here. Let me find something. <laughs> Thanks, Tech. Uh, Strawberry Seventeen plays. Also, Halloween is your birthday. Hell yeah, that's awesome, Tech. Here, look. Here, how about this? Maybe this is too loud. There. Is that good? Some nice, like, library sounds going on. So you can do your homework while I'm sitting here being like... jam maybe if we hit like goals and whatnot yeah total lo-fi you got it you got it talk talk the cat um but i think the key would be to like find out what you guys if there's certain songs um over the course of the month while i'm trying to hit that like follower goal it might be fun to like just do like a little kind of concert uh and then if we have any like exceptional sort of like memories and moments like for instance doki doki um is that my... oh shit my... <laughs> hang on oh shoot sorry i think my phone's going off y'all one second <laughs> i hear it i hear it somewhere one moment <laughs> not the guitar i know one second i got Man, that's so strange how sometimes when you have your phone, um, you can like, or when you don't have your phone, do you guys ever get that like sixth sense that it's going off? I worry about that sometimes. I feel like that's what like being a cyborg is like, is you like are so used to being married to technology. You have the phantom ring. Do you guys ever get the phantom ring in your, in your pocket? Where you're like, I feel like my phone's ringing somewhere. And then it rings and you're like, the airwaves bro okay anyway but yeah so hopefully if that follower goal hits by the end of the month i'll try to do like maybe like a, a concert of some kind uh might be cool i don't know we'll see I'm trying to figure it out i'm still brainstorming but uh guitar is fine crystal guitar is fine let me see yeah i think guitar is fine <laughs> okay um main scene let me turn off uh turn off that that fireplace Fireplace sound. So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Hey, thanks for the follow. Key and Rar. Rar. Yes. When it rings, you actually ignore it. I, uh, man, Tommy. Okay, I've I've had enough of listening to Tommy. We got to keep pushing, guys. Can't believe it's already ten okay. o'clock here. Let's go. Joel, what? All right. Oh, me, kiddo. Reload. Huh. I think we already checked out everything. Huh. So, 
So, you and Tommy cross anything when you was out? Just the few we saw from the ridge. Oh, it's like super loud now, huh? You? Uh, you know, found two runners in a house. Am I writing you? Tells me you're handling Young your own Shimmer. Quite well on the group patrol. He's even recommending you for paired patrols. Oh shoot. Well, I think you're still a bit young for it. I'm a better shot than almost all of them. And I have more experience than most of the new recruits who You think you're ready? I trust you. Okay. Thanks. You just do me a favor and start with the shorter routes for now. You know, see how you handle them. Right. Hey, Raijin, what's up? Hey, do you remember those, uh, Savage Starlight comic books that you're into? Yeah. Tommy and I found some when we were moving through that school the other day. Did you like them? Oh, you know what? It's not really my cup of tea, but... Dr. Daniela Starr, I mean, she's pretty... She's a savage. Well, what she does to Captain Ryan in that death match... Woo. Yeah. I mean, he definitely deserved it, but... That was a nice twist how they escaped him. <laughs> You're funny. What's going on here? Beautiful sunlight through trees. Listen to that music creeping up. Something's about to go down, I can tell. This calls, like, I don't know, man. If What happens if I take away Joel, though? Let's see. Oh, it takes away his horse, too? Damn it. All right. That's whack. Look how beautiful Ellie. Ellie's like, this is awesome. Fortunately, I can't get Joel. It's cool. We'll do it another time. Oh, did you say you want to do the game with subtitles, Rocco? Yeah, no, that's fine. I could probably use it too. Let me see. Uh, let's do it all. Let's let's do it all. I'm gonna make a large. Oh shit, that's huge. Early, come on, let's go. All right, how about that? Is that helpful, Rocco? All right, let me know if that's better. Doki Doki was dope talk. Doki Doki was freaking rad. Boomer text, like from Gears of War. Boom. Funny story. Um, the gentleman who plays the Boomer in Gears of War uh, I worked at his theater, the Undermain Theater, uh, and that is where I got my actor's equity card. So, just so you know, if you're thinking about the boomer from Gears of War. Music stores up that way. We have to leave the horses here. Yeah, sounds good. Oh, Shimmer, don't get into trouble. Oh, young Shimmer. Shimmer, can I pet you? You're a good horse. I need a photo with you, I think. Shimmer. Shimmer, you're beautiful. I, par I parked Shimmer the wrong way, I think. <laughs> Ellie's not exactly in the right spot. Hang on, I got that. There we go, that'll be better. Girl and her horse. Shimmer. I wish I could, like, move. Oh, there we go. Dope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Dude. you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Look at that weird thing floating above Shimmer's head. Do you see that, like, little thing of light hitting Shimmer's head? I'm going to capture it. 
a while in it. All right, and now we're gonna go no filter, no frames, just some logos. Yeah, go to the top right. Uh, make it big. Hell yeah. That's a nice. That's a nice shot. I think. Shimmer. Yes. Wait. A horse girl? I don't understand. That music store. Okay. Yeah, I see it. So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Thanks for the follow. I'm a dork. Eleven O's thirty-seven, or it could be a matterk. <laughs> Ooh, they got shot. The sheriff was shot, including the deputy. Um, Let's see what else we got going on. It's over here, huh? Stuff. Ooh, what's this though? This is what we need. Damn it. Sounds a little off. Let's poop. Eh? Favorite horse girl? I don't I don't understand. There's people laughing in chat, so now I'm like confused. Is this like a dirty, sexy thing <laughs> that I'm about to walk into? Because uh, I know we're playing Last of Us too, but I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trying to go like X-rated right now. I got it. <laughs> okay, thank God. You guys, uh, I don't know what's happening right now. <laughs> Obsessed with horses. Dig it. Um, I actually, well, I grew up on a farm and we had sheep. We had sheep to our right uh, and we had like a burro, a horse. Man, our other neighbor had a ton of ton of livestock, but uh, all we had on our, on our property was um, a field of corn, 13 cats, two dogs, uh, and like some waterfowl that would come by to like drink in our well and eat the, the little fishes that were in there. There were, there were fishes in there, though. It's kind of weird. It was my fault. I think I put some, like, goldfish in there, and they got all fat and huge. Ah, nature. Um, what's up, Hannah? Yeah, it was nice. I was grateful for it, man. I feel like, uh, even though it was, like, pretty lonely, and my, my pop didn't really, like, let me have friends at all, it was still pretty cool um, to, like, be one with nature and all that. Thick goldfish. <laughs> tab, back tab. Those goldfish are thick. Oh, thanks, Joey. Yeah, I think the. Uh, I don't think we can go this way. What? <laughs> what? Hey, Bam. Used to be able to swim across there. Okay, so now what? Well, if you're up for it, we can try cutting through that hotel. I'm up for it. What is this? What is this? Huh? Ooh. Um. I was gonna say. Uh, oh, I've been looking for this one. Already worth coming here. <laughs> Already worth coming here. Um. I totally lost my train of thought. Sorry. Love you guys too. It's uh. I think because I was so introverted for my my younger life. Like now that I'm a grown ass man, I am just voracious with my you know camaraderie <laughs> i'm like no time to waste friend 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 <laughs> good night joey what's up joe we used to uh well i used to take our cats and i would toss them 
on the sheep when the sheep had full full coats before they were sheared uh and the cats would like pff, just land on them like velcro please don't say it was a uh, abusive because i was like 11 and i didn't i didn't know any better but they were safe they were cool like it was all right anyway the Ostringer, real name, Maxence Pierre. Brain, 60, brawn, 40. Affiliation, none. At 14 years old, Maxence Pierre was abandoned by his parents in the middle of Montagne Noire. With the help of a benevolent, intelligent hawk, he made his way to a small lodge where he met the mysterious shaman. Through rigorous training, Max mastered the ability to enter the minds of hawks, raptors, and other birds of prey. As the Ostringer, Max serves as a thief, thief for hire, and intelligence gatherer for the highest bidder, all while striving to discover why, why he was abandoned in the mountains all, ah, oh, fuck, I slipped into German. Uh, abandoned in the mountains all those years ago. Neutral. Friend must make friend. Totally, Tab. You got it. Hercule Pirot. <laughs> oh no. I, I gotta work on my dialect. It's actually my homework I gave myself for um, going uh, to this wedding because I'm gonna be on the road for like 40 hours, uh, 20 hours up, 20 hours back. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and practice my dialects. I found a rare hero card right in that ditch. Wait, he's still collecting those things. Don't be jealous. I'll be my damn. What is this though? Thieves of Dawn? I didn't even look at that. Yeah. I'm going uh ten hours to Atlanta. Ten hours to Pennsylvania. 10 hours to Falls Creek, and then 10 hours to Dallas. Oh, that might be something. You think you can fit in there? Well, it's worth a shot. In there? Oh, shoot. Now. Yep. Oh, man. Ellie. I'm about to fight some effective. Through. Hold on. All right. Is my hearing upgraded right now? Well, I'm moving slow as balls, so I guess all that medicine we drank in uh in Last of Us One is not paying off now. Uh, looking. Man, I'm just like used to. Uh, oh, is that spores? No way. Ooh, what's that? Gotta get Joel in here, eh? Well, hello. <laughs> Howdy. You impressed? Nope. You're just too skinny. Need to eat more. Ha! <laughs> Joel. You're welcome. Nope. You're just too skinny. Joel is not the same man because I recall a version of him that we would search every last nook and cranny this together. This place is giving me the creeps. I think I see a way through, but we got spores. Put your mask on. <sighs> Do I have to? It's just us. What if we run into someone? Okay, fine. <laughs> Eventually, you're gonna slip up in front of someone you shouldn't. 
I've never slipped. You ain't told nobody, do, have you? Not Jesse, Dina. Of course not. Okay, good. Oh, they took the TV off the wall. That's how you know this place is just chaotic. They don't care about anything. streets. Feeling like a bit of an oversight now. Maybe. Let's make some Molotovs, bro. <laughs> well, I can rely on Joel's ability to be, you know, invincible. Carlincy, we're getting a. Uh, when I come back next week, we're gonna be getting our Kit Kat. Get our cat. I'm so excited. Ooh, are you bad guy in here? Okay. Bottle. Yeah, I'm gonna be sharing the hell out of that that creature. Yeah. Well, we're gonna be fostering three of them. Uh, but uh, yeah. So I'm excited to share with y'all. Joel's got a shoddy out. Shoddy. Even Joel's all stealthed out now. He must, he must hear something as well. Hmm. Looks like he was shot a while back. When did the last patrol go through here? Not sure. Is it one of us? Man. Only people went missing from Jackson and teenagers from last year. This was too old. Now it just rolled in. Hmm. Interesting. So we came from here, right? Oh, my goodness. How could I pass all this up, you guys? Give me that, and give me that. What am I doing? Like I'm a big old rookie. Oh my god, look at all this treasure. Although I will admit, the, uh, Audio cues are kind of making me a little nervous. Oh, that's right, Raito. Uh, Raito, help me out by saying that if your HUD isn't displayed like the little ammo meter and health, then there's no enemies around, which is brilliant. But I'm always like, I'm always just on edge, bro. Those are rookie wounds. Thanks, Anya. I appreciate the support. <laughs> In here? I went this way, though. Didn't I? Oh, okay. My bad. This way. I gotcha. Come here. They give us so many bricks, bro. Joel's 
Sorry, I can tell it's like super loud, you guys. Apologies. Because you're about to get blown up if it goes... <laughs> if it gets loud. I can tell. If you hear that, it's going to be loud. We're going to be all right on you. Oh, shoot. Nice, bro. You're doing great. Where? No. Joel, we got this. There. Got one. Do it, Joel. You've got infinite ammo. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're doing great, Joel. I got your back. I got this bottle. Listen, Anya. Joel's great. Oh, yeah, go invade, Ruby Chanel, right? This is Last of Us Part 2. Oh, is it super, super loud? Here, hang on. Blah. What's up, Zanri? Um, yeah, I think we're good, right? The HUD's still up, but I've got a bottle. And as you can tell, I'm unbeatable with the bottle. Actually, two bottles. Hell yeah. So much stuff. Ooh, give me that. Yes. And a brick? Dude, come on now. Joel looks still ready to throw down, so maybe I should be kind of cautious right now. I'm being a little cavalier in my movements. You know what I'm saying? It is like Christmas morning. Another health kit. Glad I didn't craft one. Ugh, so good. Wait, I hear stuff. Over here. I hear him, I hear him. Oh my goodness, we're full on ammo? Come on, bro. Oh, wait, what was that? Yes, I will take the baseball bat. Are you kidding me? What about all this? Do it, Joel. You got this. Got faith in you. you. Got it. You got it. Uh! Need that brick, though. Oh, come on. Man, leave me alone. You're mine. Die, 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 die. Running around. Oh, what? Come on now. Uh, that's how we do it. This is how we do it. Hello! Hello, friend! Oh, I missed. Shoot. Oh, no bueno. We're doing great, Joel. Super team, super friends. All right. Joel. Easy. I think we did it. GG. 
easy. Thank you. So, what do you say we give up on those strings for today? Could have said it better myself. I think I'm gonna take this though. I think our only way out is forward now. Reload. Randy Lee. Back streets, back on life. <laughs> Joel, Joel, you are so good. Just so I know you guys, that wasn't like super loud for you, right? I know it's probably pretty loud, but it wasn't like. Come on. Yeah, I'm down. Let's go. Let's get in there. That looks like it might be something. Only you. I want it that way. Tell me why Just another runner chasing me Tell me why Now, I know we disguise these as loading points and all that, but I gotta tell you, this is asking for a jump scare. I want I want the scare in the Matrix where um, Neo, Neo and Morpheus are hiding in the walls and then Agent Smith punches his hands through like Neo's hiding, Keanu Reeves is like this, and then the hands come in through the drywall and start grabbing him. And Morpheus goes, oh! <laughs> and leaps down to sacrifice himself. You guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, um, let's see here. Oh, Leo. Leo, but you know what I'm talking about, right? Did you guys ever play like the Matrix video game where like when you shoot at the agents with your infinite ammo, they just go Anyway. <laughs> like this would be a really good good place, I think, for a photo if we could. No, we can't. If Ellie looks to camera again, I'll take one. Oh, <laughs> I totally called it, y'all. I totally called it. We're gonna fall through the floor and the monsters are there. <laughs> uh, well, so that's, uh, take a drink. Eh. Kellen, Kellen could hear me in the walls and he was like, Rico, friend. And I was like, Alan, I haven't seen you in so long. Oh, God! <laughs> Here we go. Totally. Hugo weaving in the walls. Oh, shit! Kellen! Kellen! Oh, that's a beautiful picture. Come on. I don't care who you are. That's great. Can I move the camera? Oh, that's dope. I can't. But that's... That's a great pick. I don't... Like... Kellen! It's thick, Kellen. Yeah, that's, that's Kellen, uh... That's Kellen when we've been at a convention where they've given us all you can eat. And it's like, oh, well, we can't pass this up, can we? I would look the exact same way. Did you see? Did you see the shrimp platter? Oh my god, I've got Thai food right here, you guys. What kind of what kind of fool am I that doesn't eat his dinner? Need my strength juice, Danny. Okay. It sucks, right? I didn't like... When I forget to eat food, I'm like, well, I wonder why I don't have any energy and it's super hard to stay awake. <laughs> Maybe I need to put fuel in my body. Yeah, me neither, Bethatron. I'm, I'm having a hard time understanding if uh, the insides are out or the outsides are in. I'm... <laughs> 
Okay. Oh, runner. Oh, bro. Where'd it go? Uh, he just broke through the Kellen. You don't need to break the drywall like that. Oh no! Ah! Nice! Joel! Joel! Joel, that was great. Okay, did you see him almost tear open my mouth? Like, that would have been horrible. But Joel saved me. Uh. We should do another picture and go, Callan. <laughs> that wasn't very plus ultra of you, Callan. <laughs> Callan, no! I think Callan just wanted to talk. Hang on. Damn it. There we go. Oh shit. <laughs> That's good. All right. Thanks, Tech. Let's get up. Get up, stand up. That was too close. That was just too close. Sure. Fucking did it. I gotta say, you good? um, other than being really old, other than being really old, ain't nothing solid, not a sleepover shake off. I want to get out of here. Kellen, Kellen, look up, Kellen. Hey. What are you doing? Kellen. What if there's like two bloaters back there? It'll be fine. There was one runner back here though that was like just kind of hanging out. He's like, hey bro. Quite the fight back there, huh? Oh my god. I think he pathed, um, if you noticed, Kellen, even though he could have easily just walked through the door, he wanted to break through the drywall, which I respect. I respect that. <laughs> gotcha, bitch. <laughs> Wait, who was in pain? Oh man, I missed something. Killer smash. Let's craft another molly. Oh, I'm sorry, Zenry. I, I will admit one of the reasons why I'm sort of tentative to, to get an animal is because of that, the sort of 
inevitable. Dino are gonna lose their shit when they hear about this. Dino, goodbye. But the love, the amount of love you can share with a, a creature, man. No, Jesse and I are just friends. Not so keen with this one. Let's see. <laughs> Don't hold your breath. Look at all this workout gear. Guys, we can get so jacked. Is that a cloth? Sweet. I'm gonna freaking stick that workout rag into a Molotov cocktail. Let me tell you. Oh, I'm full? No way. I am. Can I even heal at all? I don't need it. Joel, you need heals? You look kind of jacked up. I know you old, but... So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. <sighs> yeah, I know, Rx Mina. It's like, you get an animal, and you're like, do I get another one? Um, oh, thanks for the follow, Sakura R88. Um, I've lost so many animals. I told you guys I grew up on a farm, so having 13 cats, you know, sometimes just random stuff would happen. One of our cats, this sounds gruesome, but it's not, um, like, as, as you might imagine. But uh, one of our cats, Cakes, got stuck in a thresher, which is where it threshes the, the uh, hay. But it wasn't on, it didn't thresh her. She just, um, like, went into it, probably chasing something, and got stuck inside and couldn't get out. And we couldn't find her for a while. And, you know, there's so many animals and we're feeding them all. We're calling her. We don't know where she's at. And, uh, yeah, that was one that I remember thinking, damn it, if only I'd spent more time walking the acres of the perimeter, I probably could have found her. But um, there's just so many creatures. You know what I mean? There's so many animals. And it's hard when, like, you can't keep track of all of them. I mean, you try. Uh, but especially cats, I feel like they're so... Um, you know, they're so curious. They like to get into things and, and I don't know. I love cats though. As you guys could probably already imagine, I've got, hang on, where did, oh yeah, Bongo Mario's there. Look at Bongo Mario. Fucking love cats. Power, power. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. <laughs> Bongo Mario. I feel, oops, I'm going to miss circle. Sorry, y'all. I'm kind of like distracted talking about animals. Um, I'm glad to hear it, Zenry. I'm grateful to your kitties for, for keeping you, keeping you alive and well. Animals can do it for you, man. There's such, ah, I just, I love creatures. And those are my tape, my favorite type, Anya. The uh, dog cats, the ones that are like, that will play fetch. I think one of my favorite things is um, when a cat hasn't been introduced to Red Laser. Oh shit. Red Laser, you guys. Do it, Joel. Open it. Do it, bro. You got it. Got your back. Yes, Leo. The hot new drug. You want to try some of that red laser? Bro. Hey, Leo, when you were at UCI, did you get to train with uh, Dennis and Marana? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. I'm going to take a quick pause here um, and eat some more of this food. Good night, Anya. Or, wait, who's going to sleep? Anyway. I'm going to have vanilla. <laughs> Sorry, I got it backwards. Oh man, Dennis Castellano and Marana Delaney. Musical, musical theater folks. Oh. How about Gary Busby? I like pointing red laser on the roof 
and letting the cats chirp. Or they're like, they make that little bird bird tripping sound. It's my favorite. Oh, bummer. Ori's a great name, Zhao. Um, and no worries, Anya. You go. Yeah. They're like trying to imitate the bird claw. It's badass. Thanks, sweet Benel. Double strength. See what it is? Yeah. Oh, Karlinsti, but that means that your cat's trying to feed you. She's like, you're not a good hunter. I feed. Whoa. Uh oh. <laughs> that that shrieking sound, y'all. Sorry if I'm ruining the scares, by the way. I just like I like taking pictures. Look at Joel's foot. <laughs> Spider pig, spider pig. Nice. Easy. Thanks. Yeah. Jay. Hey, Joel. Hmm. I think it's them. Well, that ran away last year. I think you're right. What happened? Jackson is a wonderful place, but we got tired of hearing the stories of people suffering everywhere else. He wanted to save lives. He had good intentions. We didn't make it an hour before running into a horde. Now we're bitten. We've decided we're going to end our lives instead of trying. Please tell our family and friends that we're sorry. Uh, Both Adam and Sydney. Damn. I shot her. Plays like a freaking movie, you guys. This game's great. I can't take my own life. I'm a fucking coward. Adam. Told me they were immune, right? Oh, Joel. Joel's like, what have I done? Joel's like, yeah, if only they were immune. After you took me out of the Firefly Hospital. Oh shit, oh shit. You said there were dozens of people like me. Yeah. yeah that's what you told me. Ooh, Joel, you're fucking lying. Oh no. Oh no. Thanks, the champ, 2025. By the way, uh, yeah, I just, because I had Aaron and Sarah with me, I just, like, I could feel it coming. But dude, Joel's lying right now in Last of Us Part Two, And, ah, uh, Dad's lying. I've never met another immune person before. Have you? I could be hiding. You do. Do you believe that? I'm 
Is now really the time for this? Oh, Joel. We traveled across the entire country to bring you to the Fireflies. I had so many questions for them. You fucking murdered him, bro. Why did you pull me out of there while I was still unconscious? Because I let them run the tests. And when I saw that they were useless, I got us out of there. How do you know they were useless? Maybe if you, you just would have given them more time, they could have figured something out. things were different. I wish things were different. But they ain't. Oh, man. I don't know what to believe, you guys. Oh. This is just some terrific acting, by the way. Like, I've waited so long for... Oh, my focus went out. Sorry. I've waited so long for this conversation. Why is my camera having a hard time focusing on my face? There we go. Um... I've been waiting, I've been waiting for a long time for this conversation to happen between Joel and Ellie. And, uh, golly. Thanks, Henry. <laughs> Too pretty. No, I think the camera's like, oh, please, enough. Uh, I think I've had enough. <laughs> Because I was leaning forward, I'm like, oh. we need to get these kids back to their families. Is there something else you'd like to rehash? No. <sighs> Come. Come on. Yes, Zhao. I'm ready to boost you over. But you gotta hit triangle. We got someone to walk up and hit the triangle thing. Jesse's passed out. Hey, let me do that. He's a good guy. Why didn't you tell him? It wasn't the right time. There you go. She just totally risked like getting affected right there. I just want you to know. <laughs> what about this? Anything worthwhile? Uh, actually, uh, Abby? You know, this girl, Nora, her unit was assigned to this hospital. They were collecting supplies or something. This hospital? Yeah. Wait, you're gonna go now? Yeah, we have a lead. Like, at least just wait for Jesse to rest up. She could be gone by then. We know her location. Maybe Tommy does too. What? Nothing. Good. Oh shit, she's just like Joel. Good. Fuck it, moving on, let's go. Can you come help me with the door, please? Joel and Ellie are so similar. Right. If I follow Route 5, that should take me to the hospital. Follow Route 5. 
Let me in. Track down Nora. Get her to tell me where Abby is. Easy. Uh, Ellie, you're making bad decision, man. But I get it. I don't think I've ever um, <clears throat> sympathized so much with like a character's sort of like modus operandi. Uh, as complex as it is, you know, with all the stuff going on. I feel like I haven't got pill pills in a while. Oh, hello. Something here? No, nothing there. Route five. That away. <laughs> if only there were morphine pills. I feel like they're gonna end up tracking uh, Ellie. And then they're gonna end up capturing Dina and uh, and Jesse is what I think is gonna occur. If I had to guess like nightmare scenario, what would happen? Do you know what I mean? And this game loves to just make me feel nightmare things. So, break the shit. Oh good, I still got my, my freaking lance from earlier. I don't I don't know what the dog part is, Anya. Please no spoilers. <laughs> By the way. <laughs> Sorry. I'm like, what? I've killed some doggos. That's what you're talking about. Um, let's see. Let's change my range. Yeah, I need forty. Oh, one more! I need one more. Rusty, bro. Huh. Is this like a place I would hide then? Oh. This is a place I would jump down to. Okay. And there's no HUD yet. Gotta get through. Hmm. And Ellie, take some parkour. Land a little bit more gracefully. That's all right. Oh, okay. Yeah, give me that, dude. Some parts. All about that. Do we have any explosives we can craft? We cannot. Uh, I guess we would go down would be the way. Well, maybe. Ironic that that's the piece that I need for silencer <laughs> as I make massive amounts of sound. I don't think Ellie knows how to fall safe. Tab. But that's okay, because she's, she's pretty boss. She still can, like, just... Ooh, what's this? What's this? A door for employees only. Not going on here, eh? Yes, I will 
take your one round. And your take. And your one part, it looks like. Can I really? Is that all I got? Man. All right, well. All right, well. Guess not two shabs. Oh, dope. Give me that. <clears throat> Randy Styles. Oh, is he like a uh, Nightcrawler? A hundred brains, 80 brawn, no affiliation. Once he was Dr. Uckman's research partner, working late nights to develop all manner of technology for the betterment of mankind until one day he just vanished. Months later, reports surfaced of styles showing up in numerous places all over the world. A brief appearance in Mexico, a short stint in Japan, a materialization in Australian outback. With each visitation, he helps people in need and vanishes again. Some speculate Styles obtained this ability through an accident with Dr. Uckman's experimental quantum teleporter, though he vehemently, vehemently denies those claims. He's neutral. Oh, you just reminded me, Anya, with that peach tea comment that I have a tea in the other room that I got. One of those big old cans, not the Arizona cans, but like a, a one shock and shell dope. Who knows how many worlds are at that hospital? Um, I think it's like a peace tea. That's what it's called. Um, all right, I think I've got all the things. A little shopping before we go move ahead. Yeah, I mean, I guess we good, huh? That's it. That's all we should wrote. Right. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Although, it can craft something. I can craft some arrowheads. Ah, we'll wait on it. In this journal over here. Nothing? All right. Man, the hospital, the hospital looks spooky, yo. I feel I'm emboldened, though, because I'm super geared, so I feel like I could probably take a few. I'm a big tea drinker. That would be a fun thing to do. That would be a fun uh, panel to have. Just brew a bunch of like hot tea. Just sit in a massive tea circle. Oh, hello. Tell me your name. Too late, I take your gun. Oh no! Okay, one more, one more ammo, one more shell. Oh, I'm still full, that sucks, okay. All right, whatever. Damn it. Oh. Are you serious? Bro, it's gotta be. Is there no peaceful way to get in there? You're gonna make me break the glass. <sighs> well, I guess they are. I feel confident though that there's gotta be, there's gotta be a stealth way. Yeah, that, that'll be good, Demonic. And if 
anything, I do want to probably tangle with them out in the open. So I have like a decent shot, you know what I'm saying? All right, let me go. So one of them is a smoke bomb, right? Oh, that's a stun. Yeah, we want trap mine for sure. All right, is that a clicker? Oh, they're both clickers, okay. Um, about one right there. And then, now we go far, far away. And a brick, a brick should do it. Oh man. Man, darn it. I swear, one of those freaking stupid uh, runners better not get a hold of it. Someone's got eyes on me hard. the hell sees me, bro? This is irritating. I feel like I'll have better success if I just freaking go loud this way. But I want to make sure they're coming. But now I feel like I can just stealth them. Maybe I can even just save it. What a dummy you are. All right. Well, hang on. Damn it. All I have are my, my heavy weapons. I'm 
full of that too? Son of a gun. I've got all the things, y'all. I think one of these dropped like a pair of scissors. Where'd he go? Over here somewhere? I ran a big wide. Yeah, I gotcha, I gotcha. Hospital. Yes, I understand. Thank you. You had a rag, you had a rag. One of you fools had a pair of scissors, and I know it's here. Alright, whatever. Fuck it. Let's go inside. Oh, thanks, Tab. I'll check it out. Let's see. Bar is open for business. Now, there's something gratifying uh, about being able to go loud in this game with the infected, because typically, you know, especially the way they kind of taught you at the top of the game, they're like, hey, listen, if you're overwhelmed, you're going to want to get the F out. And um, I think story-wise, like, they do a good job of sort of making you feel like, okay, this is, now is the time to run. Do you know what I mean? Like, you can kind of gauge it and, and know that I think it's best rather than to expend our resources to, to just gun it. Um, but I like having this big open field. Talking. Yes. Listen mode range. Oh my god, craft more arrows? Yes. The irony is that I actually have been pretty much going loud this entire time. <laughs> Even though I know I, I say I like to play stealth, but I'm also at heart just like All right. Survivor style, so I'm like, let me just get all my items. Oh, what is this? He's got a thing on him. Woods, here's the list of deserters. Ji So Huang, female, 5'4 Asian. Andre Dominguez, male, 5'7 Hispanic. Chris Marsh, male, 5'11 Caucasian. Adam Peters, male, 5'6 Black. We know some of the supplies they still contain weapons. Be careful, all preferable to capture them alive. Do not risk your lives. Any sign of danger, you have my permission to take them out. If they wanted to leave, we could have worked something out. But desertion with stealing cannot be tolerated. We need to make an example here. May your survival be long. May your death be swift. Good luck. Thanks, Isaac. Your handwriting's incredible. So, that's the hospital? I don't think I like got to check everything out fully yet. What's this? Those parts, bro. <laughs> I notice you are also a purveyor of stealth. <laughs> well, if they didn't, they just give it to me all the time, aren't you? I don't know what to do. Listen. Alright. What do we got? We still have tons of that. Hear like anything? Sound like anything in there? Let's see what they got in here. I don't need any of these supplies. I'm so freaking locked and loaded. But whatever. I don't like that. That is what I what I've hated the most right now. I really didn't like that.
Thanks, Demonic. Okay, we gotta get to secure our exit first. Bunch of bunch of cans. Or bottles rather. So this place is defended. Gotta make sure there's no freaking bombs and crap gonna blow me up. Cause not only would that be crappy for you guys on the ears, but then I just I wouldn't feel good about it. Let's see, uh Oh, is that something? Okay. But I'm glad our uh, listening speed, movement, and also range is increased. So I feel more just confident now about being able to move. Oh, hello, you? I guess we should cl clear this one at a time, right? Make sure no one gets the drop on us. Yeah, did not like bottles, let me tell you. Oh shit. Are we gonna have to like climb out the window on this one? Yeah, looks like it. <laughs> Listen, Anya. I know how to handle some Zeds, okay? But. When you see household items in weird spots, that's something else, okay? That means there's been some forethought. Look at that coffee cup, like this. Oh, <laughs> I can pick that up, my bad. <laughs> Do you see? Do you see this? Who put that there, huh? Not a zombie. Someone. Look at all of these bottles and cups. Pissing me right off. Man, the city's still filled with supplies. Yeah, I guess a lot of folks freaking died. Damn. Are these full of water? Oh my god, they have rain catchments? These guys are sustainable as hell. I guess I can go ahead and make some, huh? Feeling good. Listen, y'all, you're, you're giving me crap now, but like watch when the bottles summon like all of the bad guys. And I'm like, you see? You see what happened? The so bottles summoned everyone. Training rookie noobs. Thanks for the follow, Merlin. Oh shit, you Bye. So, when I tell you that bottles symbol people, I'm right. <laughs> Just to let you know. <laughs> the cup was a lie. Yeah, where am I at? Where am I at, bro? You don't know where I'm at. You better start running. No. Oh! Bye, bro. Nobody is running anywhere. Jesus. What the fuck, people? Now, let me... Can I go back to working on my shit? Jeez. Thanks for the hammer, though. Oof. I shot... Ooh. Ooh. I didn't realize I got such a good shot with my shotgun. That wasn't, that wasn't pretty. And she, the worst thing was, is that I think she, she thought she had the angle on me. Like she was right here. She was right here and she's like, ah, she must be like, like over, over here is what she thought. She's like, she must be behind there. But I was like, man, I see you. I see you right there, <laughs> you big dumb. And then when you get flanked, that's, that is literally what happens. Sorry. I'm sorry, bro. 
said I'm sorry. Alright. <laughs> let's, let's work on our stuff. I didn't, Demonic. That's cool. I gotta check it out. So I... you're the newbie and training rookie. Members. Oh, thanks for the follow, uh, Cat Yuffie. Uh, so when I heard the footsteps running up behind me while I was looking at my gun like that, I don't know if you guys heard me like... <laughs> get out of the menu, get out of the menu, get out of the menu. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, oh, that freaking... Raised the hair on the back of my neck. Anyway, probably Ivan. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's figure this out. Oh, Bo. That's right. I remember what I was gonna do. All right, let's get this baby going. Automatically mark the distance of enemies on the reticle. Yes. Hey, Cat Yuffie. Welcome. All right, we've got Range Finder. Sadly, we can't do stability, but we can do draw speed. I'm all in, man. All in on the bow. Warm blood melts snow. Damn, demonic. So clean. All right, well, we've done the best we can. Uh, only missing a handful of things, but, well, actually quite a bit, but, yeah, we need, I'm not sure why I had this up even. I should have had this guy up. Wait, I thought it was going to show the, uh, the thing. Well, anyway, that's cool. Oh, you had a, a beach party? That's awesome, Tech. Yeah, I still need to do... Uh, I'm going to do a stream where it's like me pulling weeds, essentially, on my island since I haven't played for a while. I would love to tag it up with Caitlyn because she's been like... Her island looks amazing. Wait, were these guys kind of infected, by the way? They kind of look like they were starting to... Yeah. Yeah, they are starting to grow a little bit. If you guys noticed that. Um... Oof. Damn, the blood, the blood splatters, though, guys. Like, oh, that's where I broke my, broke my pipe off on her head. Oof. Well, let's just make some more blood stains. That's that's fine. All right. Well, Rico de Brutal. Oh, no, Tech. You know how it is. We all want to, like, make our island all nice and pretty for everyone and then invite them over, so I appreciate it, but it's my my burden to bear. Where did they come from, by the way? Do you think they came from the other room? Or, like, you know what I mean? All right, let's see here. What is this? Give me that. Hey, Melissa. I'm leaving this here in case you decide to join us after all. We're moving on from the safe house at first light. I've stalled the others as long as I could, but Isaac has to be looking for us by now. The fate of the last group of deserters is still fresh in our minds. The plan is still to head south and see if those rumors are true. Maybe it's all bullshit, but I'll take hospital bullshit over Isaac's fanaticism any day of the week. Remember who we were. The wolf took us in, but they're not our people. I really wish you had left the stadium with us. Hope you still do. Jiso. Look at all the pills, y'all. Did I take any damage on that? I think I might have been untouchable on that one. Dang, they didn't even freaking touch me, bro. Okay, well, what was this? <gasps> Training manual? What is it? I should skim through this. Skim. You're gonna read all that? The whole 11th edition? Organic chemistry concepts and practice 11th edition. Weinberg, Kapoor, and Omanuko. All right, let's read it. Let's go. What do we got? What do we got? Craft explosive arrows? <gasps> Come on. 
Wait, what is this tree? Craft more explosive arrows. Oh, man. That's cool. More trap mines, more molotovs. Oh. These are good, y'all. And that means I can make use of more, like, stuff. Do you know what I mean? Like, I can have more, more inventory, more capacity. I still want to get that at some point. Smoke bombs looks pretty good. Hold breath. Craft more arrows. I feel like that's, man, I can't decide, you guys. And it's quiet, though. Yeah, I gotta do at least that. All right, we'll figure out the rest later, but. Is it just one, though, that I get? It is. That's still cool, though. I'm still all about it. Because um, that means that we can at least use the stuff, you know? I think that's more important, being able to, like, utilize it. again y'all i feel this is really like such a collaborative effort on us navigating this game together <laughs> all right we already got that we're going all bow bow spec it seems like we're doing um we didn't even check out the other room yet huh the other way the other uh, room across the way gotta be more careful yeah no shit bro could we not have gone upstairs oh we yeah we couldn't have like it's blocked it's funny to me how they're always like, listen, there is a chair here and there's no way you're gonna get over it, bro. I'm like, yeah, you're right. Could that have been a way in? I guess not. What else is around here? What is this? Is this the back area or something? Hmm. Anyway. Anyone care about that? Guess not. I'm curious how, if I add a extra damage thing to my... What is it? Um, to my hammer. Dude, I feel like someone's about to come out. Oh, what was that? Man, I'm all paranoid now. Now that I think that they're here. Just gonna, just gonna check all your shit, that's all. Just relax. Very relax, alright? Taking some stuff, all right? It's not a big deal. Darling, I got everything packed, but Fedra's already starting to put people on buses, and I have no idea where you've disappeared to. If I'm gone before you get back, I stashed a few of my things in the safe. Maybe an overabundance of caution, but Fedra's been confiscating things due to quarantine. All smells fishy to me. Accommodation is still set to our wedding date. I mean, it's been 30 years, but I assume you remember that. When that was, right? See you soon. Love, Ellen. Smiley face. Look at the look at the smiley face. Oh. I guess I should look on the calendar, huh? Where is there a calendar here? It's probably in the back somewhere. 
probably in this place where there's broken glass and stuff. Um, should I prepare my... Uh, really didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. Regular, yes please. That's what I prefer. All right. Where is... Ooh, yeah. Plot twist guy doesn't remember the, <laughs> the wedding date. Shit, I can't get the ammo. Oh, that's funny, you see his body by the safe. It's like, oh, fuck, I forgot our anniversary. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Star sign. Uh, Zhang Li, 80 brains, 80 brawn, Society of Champions. Once a humble museum curator, Zhang Li was poring over Han Dynasty scrolls when he found himself transformed by the spirits of the great Chinese emperors. Now, depending on the hour of the day, he takes on the elemental power from each sign of the Chinese zodiac. Terrakinesis, pyrokinesis, aquakinesis, pharaokinesis, and arborkinesis. Pharaoh? What's the Latin root pharaoh? I know arbor is tree, terra is earth, pyro is fire, aqua is water. Oh, must be wind. Pharaoh must be wind. He also takes on both the positive and negative personality traits of each sign, which can be an advantage or disadvantage depending on the situation. Best hope you can catch him at a good time of day. Neutral hero. Oh, iron? Interesting. Thank you, Deathatron. I thought it was like wind, water, earth. I'll probably go look at the pictures, huh? Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's get your get this stuff first. Can I not? Come on, man. Trying to make use of all those explosives, yo. <clears throat> uh, read. Health screening, 10-4. <laughs> That's kind of funny. 10, 8, 13. Ten, eight, thirteen. Right? Did I get that wrong? Let me double check. Ten, eight. Yeah, I did that. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you thought the same thing, Ivan. As I said, I was like, wait, thirtieth anniversary. Shit. Got it. So minus thirteen. That's seventeen. Oh, back of that. Use your math. 83? Is that right? Yeah? 10883? I can always listen for the sound, too. It'll let me know. Heard it. What have you got for me? Pills. Pills here. Pills. Um Am I full of that? Did we reload. Reload. Man, am I really gosh. Alright. I don't know why they keep making me want to use my explosive ammo. I do not want to do that. And they close that door back up. Let's see, uh, faster crafting, hold breath now, improve trap mines, improve them all. See, these, these seem cool, but like those are handy, but now I gotta, I gotta go back for, for regular old arrows, I think. What's up, everybody? I'm outside. It. Ooh, 
the lightning here? So much for following the street. No way through. Okay, cool. Okay, we don't want to go in there. Did we? What is this? I feel like I didn't go in there, whatever that is. Or did we? Surely we didn't come this way already. No, this is the... Oh, wait, is it conference center? What the heck? Feel her love. Feel it. I'm not really feeling her love. Feel her love. The fuck? Yeah, I'm not really digging the uh, the culty vibes. That's kind of poop. Oh, I'm full of uh. No, I need binding. Ding it. Okay, it's all good. If I can remember that we have some scissors over here, I will remember. Friendos that I can hear. Looks like there's a. What is that? What is this? Look at that. Hmm. Okay. I guess for now, anyway. Hmm. You know, for being stealth, Ellie is loud as a fuck. <laughs> I probably need that to like go over there or something, huh? What is it attached to, anyways? Oh, it's attached to that. Okay. Maybe I can go out here. Oh, usually it goes over something, right? Hang on, let's let's see if there's something in here that we can do. Locked. Damn okay. it. There's some good stuff in there. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, okay. I gotcha. Let's put that down first. And then... I guess maybe it'd be like that one. Hey, come on now. Maybe it's this one after all. Hang on. Where's that brick? Give me that brick. Brick killed a guy. Let's...
Give me that. Give me, give me the... The rope, please. Thank you. Oh, fucking pick it up! Okay. Wait, what? Alright, well, maybe then. Can I get a shot out here? Like, over there? Man. Hang on. Like, I'm confident that's what I gotta do. I feel like it anyway. But now I don't want to waste a gunshot round. I think I might have to. Oh, wait. There we go. Bottle. Thanks, naughty dog. Oh my god. Damn it. Oh, kind of? Shit. <laughs> Ellie, <clears throat> you are the master of rope throwing. There we go. Alright. Now, I, I think I can drop and then swing, right? R1? There we go. Uh, come on. Let's we can do it. Uh, we got it. Yay! We made it in, guys! Immediately attacked by zombos. <laughs> oh, thanks, Anya. You guys are... Talking shout outs. Let's see. Oh man, again with the shotgun. And we're full of all the stuff. We need binding. If we can get some binding, that'd be dope. Need bandages, painkillers, vitamins, antacids, thermometer, pillows. Days. Okay. Damn. What's this? Simon, I hope you never read this note. I hope I can crumple it up, burn it when you return for us. It's been, I don't know how many hours since you left. I went out to look for you and those hooded people spotted me. They shouted at me, called me a sinner, then started shooting. I ran back in and barricaded the door. All I can hear is the rain, but I'm worried they're still out there. Should I run? Should I stay? I feel completely paralyzed. I'm sorry I got so sick. I'm sorry I let you go to the hospital by yourself. I'm sorry I didn't stay hidden like you told me. If anything happens to me, I want you to know how much I love you. Please come back. I'm so scared. Oh. Damn, you guys. That letter actually kind of... Damn. Shakes me a little bit. But I got a baseball card. Or a comic card. <laughs> Shift. Uh, Gail Price. Brain 60, Brawn 60. Affiliation, Society of Champions. First glance, Gail Price looks and acts like a typical teenager. Mood swings and all. But those mood swings power her ability to increase the velocity of matter. When happy, she directs this power outward, increasing the speed of her allies and throwing her enemy off balance. When sad, she directs this power inward, allowing her to outrun her enemies and making the rest of the world feel sluggish. Though powerful, she is an unpredictable ally and an easy target for the mind manipulation tricks of motivator. Neutral hero. I think they're just collectibles, uh, Ari. Damn, so much stuff. I can't pick up a darn thing. Other than those parts. The parts were helpful. Alright, well, we got it, eh? We should probably go down the safe way so we don't break our legs or anything.
Yeah. I think Ari, I actually missed one at the beginning. Because I was moving a little too quick. And I was so excited that I had the game. <laughs> there we go. But it's cool. Maybe I'll, I'll pick it up some other time. But I still have to work through Final Fantasy. So I've got a lot of, a lot of games to play. All right, so where were we? Came from this direction, I believe, right? This is where we came up through. I think. Yeah, this feels right. Came out here, cleared those guys, cleared that. I guess that's supposed to be a 7 Eleven quick mart, yeah. That's what we came through. Cleared out that. Um, um, still playing uh, Will of the Wisp, Anya. I think uh, we barely touched that game. We got in like maybe an hour or two. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for some more back to go platformer land. Uh, we cleared that area. And I think... So we didn't try to go up the gut of the hospital. I don't think it really would allow us anyway. Um, yeah, so we gotta go around this way. I have Breath of the Wild. And I still gotta finish um, One's Justice 2, because I think I'm about like halfway through. Um, all right, should we try the door? Of course it's locked, naturally. Come on, Ellie. You knew it would be locked. Um, I wonder if there's anything in the garbage truck, though. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, if I were ha loot, I would be hiding in that. It's good, though. Um, all right, let's go. A little predictable. All right. Enough. Okay. Ooh, there's a camera. That's nice. I wonder if I could... I kind of want to destroy it, eh? Let's just... Let's just shot. Fuck the camera. This is some golden eye shit right here. Alright. Well, we tried our best. creepy at all is that straight up just blood or rust either way sucks ah oh, dude we're gonna pull that and then hella things are gonna spawn oh, man <laughs> thank you Anya that's why I always laughed about Golden Knight too he's like Super, super sexy spy. <laughs> oh, we don't have quite enough tape yet. Alright, well, maybe it won't. Maybe it won't summon, guys. Maybe we can be, be positive, positive polys about this. Although, I can't help but feel like they're just going to come a-running. All right. Let's get ready. Is it going to come falling down? Okay. Okay. Oh, I gotcha. Oh, 
Oh, she knows how to pat herself on the back. Oh, okay, it's Cloud. Man, I gotta tell you, the um, Golden Eye, that fucking game, the only cheat code. Uh, my friends, my brothers, we've all tried, my sister, we all tried to earn uh, the one that we couldn't get, which was Invincibility, which was on the facility stage in GoldenEye for N64. Okay. God dang. You had to move through that stage in like two minutes and like 13 seconds? God. Couldn't make it happen, man. Couldn't make it happen. Oh, feel better, Emo. I'm actually probably, it's almost midnight where I'm at and I got an early day tomorrow. Gotta get prepped for the uh, long drive. So I might do, I'm actually gonna try to talk to Aaron and uh, Sarah tonight and see if maybe they wanna do Doki Doki tomorrow. That's kind of like a, a farewell before I leave on my trip. Um, so if you guys wanna get together for some Doki Doki, Oh wait, yeah, well, don't know if I want to go up here yet. There's the hospital. Okay. Fuck. I thought I'd be closer. Yeah, we are super far away, yo. Let's just go back. No, I'm kidding. Alright. Um, headed up. ATL, then Virginia, and then Tennessee, and then Dallas. <laughs> it's not a long road trip, John. Just going with the, the GF, my Guardian Force. Wait, what is that? Is that a reflection? Am I hearing that? Am I hearing a spirit? Um, yeah, gonna go make a journey and West Virginia, take me home, country roads. Uh, should I jump or should I break? I feel like I should break, yeah? Because I'll, I'll die if I go down there. Feels like. What's up here? What's going on up here? Whoa, wait. Comics Expo 2013? Well, this is just... Man... Come on, why you gotta do that? <sighs> Hang on. Too soon. Too soon, Last of Us. Why you gotta do that? <laughs> Disgruntled Ellie face. Hang on. We need to get it just right. Man, I'm supposed to go to, supposed to go to Scotland. I'm supposed to do all kinds of good, go to freaking England again. I'm so excited. Guys, it's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna let coronavirus get its butt kicked and then, then we can resume our, our festivities. I have a convention scheduled in September. I don't know if it's actually gonna go down, but we will we will see. Um, yeah, it's still pretty cool. I know, Demonic, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's awesome, Anya. See, like, you're a perfect example of what we should be doing with our spare time. <laughs> totally leveling up our studies and, and, you know, gig. Although I do, I have to selfishly say, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me while I've been, you know, cooped up on Twitch at home doing these things and, you know, other than getting outside for like the gym and recording from home and auditioning from home. It's been, this has been my respite hanging out with y'all. So just want to say thank you. I think I, do I have a little bit of drink left. Yeah. All right, um, I'll go conventions, sad face. And it looks like we're about to descend down into a new area. And since I haven't really had like a huge action sequence yet, I feel like we're about to throw down. So this might be a good place to save. Um, 
I feel. Hang on. Give you some. Uh... Ooh, yeah, that's nice. Give some of that. Um. Hey, Carlin Steve. <sighs> well, what a lovely playthrough, friends. Clocked in at about uh, almost two, two hours and 20 minutes of playing, taking it easy. We got our last training manual, so now we can make better explosives, start making some explosive arrows. Um, didn't finish my, my dinner, my Thai food, but that means I have lunch for tomorrow, so that's good. Um, Gonna get up early and get everything ready for my trip. Uh, again, I'm gonna reach out to Aaron and Sarah and see if they wanna do Doki Doki Literature Cl Club um, tomorrow, which would be cool. And then I'm on the road. So I'm gonna try my best wherever I'm staying to do like just a little bit of maybe like music streams. So this might be a good opportunity to, if you can think of uh, fun songs, even stuff that's not written, maybe we can like write a song. Uh, that would be fun. That'd be fun to do on the road, so. Anyway, yes, I, I already deleted Monica Karlinski, so I don't know what the game's going to do. Maybe it just makes a new one, but anyway. I'm sorry, Redheaded Raccoon. Yeah, we only went for, for a couple hours tonight. Um, I'm trying to, like, not go too late, especially this week, because I got a lot going on. But I appreciate you dropping by anyway. Rx Mina, thanks. Good night, Rico. Have a good day tomorrow, and have a safe trip. If I don't make it, thank you. Thank you, Rx Mina. Appreciate that. And thank you for them bits. Thank you for the support. Um, it'll help go to my my gasoline fund and my, my hybrid vehicle. <laughs> I wish I could do like a Tesla and just have like fancy electricity electricity take me across the country, but I'm not sure how I would manage a, a, a long trip on just the electricity and or have the money to afford a Tesla. But one day, one day super cool solar car that just takes us across the country on the power of dreams and sunlight. Um, bottles are the bad guys. I'm gonna take a look at that. Yeah, I'm stoked, Zenry. I'm seeing more of them, and that's good. Like having having more charging stations means we can actually do that. You know, have more electric cars. So, um, I I appreciate you guys hanging out. Um, Again, I'll, I'll reach out to Aaron and Sarah, see if we can do that doki doki tomorrow. And uh, yeah, please, when you think of music, you can either uh, DM me or, or let me know. And actually, I'll probably just ask you like when I'm on the stream. So Wednesday night, I'll probably be in Atlanta uh, streaming a little bit, um, just playing some music, chilling, uh, connecting with y'all. Uh, but yeah, otherwise, I have a good night. You guys are awesome. Thanks for the uh, chilling. This has been a I feel like a, these are like the best kind of nights. Even on a on a on a Monday. Holy cow! Can you believe it? It's Monday, y'all. Or I'm sorry, it's Tuesday because it's midnight here in Dallas. Anyways, all right. That said, I'm gonna hit it. Good night, y'all. Oh, <laughs> good night, Joe. Good night, Anya. Good night, Tech. Good night, redheaded raccoon. Rx Mina, Rigen. Tab McTub, appreciate you. Wait, Tab McTub runs off, the, the SpongeBob car runs off of singing? Well, then I thrash my vocal cords the whole time. Just singing Journey. Like, don't stop believing. <laughs> uh, hold on to that feeling. Straight like people. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Have a good night.